The Spaghetti Bridge Building Contest returned to Kelowna's Okanagan College on Friday for the first time in three years, giving students from across the valley a chance to compete and see who could build the best bridge. When we think about all of the infrastructure that we take advantage of every single day, uh, we don't necessarily remember that behind that infrastructure is a scientist, is an engineer, is a mathematician, is a skilled trades professional. And so to be able to have uh, the youth in, in the community and, and from beyond be able to look Look at how they can engage in, in STEM-based learning and have a blast doing it. It's just a chance to, like I said, make science fun. More than 250 middle school, high school and post-secondary students competed in the competition with awards handed out across all age groups. We just wrote a bunch of exams so we didn't really plan for it, but we used our prior knowledge in this program to come out here, use the materials that were given to us, get, use the glue, especially use a lot of glue. <laughs> Make sure it's sturdy. We used a lot of triangles, which everyone was using. We yeah. kind of stole that from everyone. Of course. And uh, yeah, we just used as much as we could and we got it done. Me and Marcus designed it. And then like we had an arch design, but then we just did rectangles, I guess, and triangles. And then we had to readjust because it kept on tilting. Fasina tells Castanet the 38th annual event is a staple in OC learning each year as it's a great learning experience for students interested in engineering. Really what we're trying to get them to focus on is some of the fundamental principles of physics, right? So how can I span uh, a certain distance uh, and not only be able to keep the, the, the structure that I've created uh, suspended, but then also be able to hang a weight from it. So it's really starting to show the structural engineering uh, and the physics side uh, of uh, of the STEM environment. I'm Braden Ursel in Kelowna for Castanet.